Okay, this story comes from Nigel Roberts at News One. Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know how, how the school systems, and this is why I'm so big on the homeschooling and that sort of thing. So, uh, school officials in Cobb County, Georgia, banned a slavery educational game and will discipline the teacher who used it. After the grandmother of the only black student in her classroom complained, WSB TV reports. The teacher at Cheatham Hill Elementary School had her lone black student play the slave in an interactive game on the Underground Railroad. Dice rolls determined whether the 10-year-old student would escape slavery or get sent back to a plantation. Unbelievable. Dolores Bunch Kimmer told WBS-TV her granddaughter came home very concerned from school. She was unlucky in the game, getting caught and returned to the plantation six times when she was beaten. Or where she was beaten. Wow. School officials gave Bunch Kenners a statement that said they were unaware of the lesson and they are taking appropriate personal action with the teacher. Yeah, she should be fired. Uh, that's the appropriate action. The teacher stated the learning activity was not intended to harm her black student, but was a history lesson to teach her fifth grade class about slavery and the Underground Railroad. However, Bunch Kenner said she told the teacher the game was inappropriate. If we did a Holocaust game and people had to roll the dice if they were going to go into the gas chamber, do you see any similarity in that? And she didn't, that it was wrong, <laughs> that it was wrong, Bunch Kidder said, sharing part of her conversation with the teacher to the news outlet. The teacher was apparently surprised by the grandmother's reaction, saying no one had complained when she used the game in the past. And see, this is the problem. This is the one of the major problems with white people, is that they don't understand racism because they've never sat down and, and, and had that conversation. And so now this young 10-year-old child had to, had to be denigrated and moralized in front of her whole class. Ridiculous. That teacher should be fired. It's no, come on, it's some sensitivity training and compassion training and all of that. She should have gotten that prior to taking this job, but she should be fired. But anyway, that's just my take. My name is Yurima Karama at Your Black World News.